these books, print portfolios and box sets are very useful for deep, intensive, tactile, experiential learning. The two examples I'll use, which are in the collection, can both be considered primary research material and that they were made by people who experienced the events being discussed, or they were made in collaboration or in tandem with people who were committed to working on the social justice issues raised by these pieces. And most times, it's both. So again, these titles don't just give us aesthetic experiences, but they give us visual information on data graphics, and they are primary research material. They're conveying aesthetic, emotional, and intellectual information, and very often scientific information. They're testimonies, they're witnesses to these times. And because of that, these books, these artworks, have resonance and are useful across disciplines, not just in the arts, not just in publishing, not just in book history, but in a variety of disciplines, sciences, humanities, um, medical sciences. And I'm going to give two examples of books in the collection that meet the description of what I've previously talked about. First, Celebrate History, Iraq Veterans Against the War is in the Clemens Artist Book Collection. And it's a collection of small documents, books, and prints, and posters that describe 10-year history of veterans coming back from Iraq and having urgently considered that it's time to stop the wars there and what the trauma of war is like. So again, there's a lot of first-person reportage happening. So this box set deals with PTSD, general trauma, conflict resolution, all the elements of war and its aftermath. On the domestic front, a book of mine, 11, is a gathering of photographs and poems of witnesses of the 9-11 bombings. Again, the book's structure, which spins around with a variant page orientation, replicates the confusion of the times, kind of um, a bit of kinesthetic mimicry. The book is a witnessing of trauma and recovery by people who felt that it was imperative to use 9-11 as a moment in history that could prompt peace instead of war. I encourage you to look at both these pieces to touch them, to feel them, to page them, so that you can get the full experience of the artwork and a little bit of experience of confronting the issues of the subject matter.